In this chapter, we will show you the settings of the 3D document. We will easily redefine some 3D settings in the 3D document window. We can choose from different options for cut and uncut surfaces. And finally, we will switch shadows on in the model. Activate the first preset view located in the Chapter 4 folder. This view shows the 2D floor plan. Activate the next preset view. This view opens the 3D axonometric window. Activate the next preset view. Select the thick marquee and draw a rectangle from point 1 to point 2. Choose the Show Selection in 3D from the context menu or press F5 on your keyboard to switch to the 3D window. Open the 3D Cutting Planes palette. Draw a horizontal line on the top right window and cut the model on the first floor. Remove the top part of the model with the Cutaway command. Switch to the Project Map in Navigator. Save the view as a 3D document. Enter 01 for the ID and Exonometric for the name. Zoom in to the model a bit. Select this view in Navigator and open its settings. Click on the Redefine Filter Elements button. We can see the filter elements in 3D palette. For example, Let's check out the column type and press OK. You can see the column will be hidden in the 3D document window. Go back to the settings and click now on the Redefine 3D Projections button. Using the cursor, move the sun to behind the camera and press OK. the surfaces of the model will be brighter. Go back to the settings again. You can see four options at the model display Cut Elements Fill Cut Surfaces with Row. Choose the first one, Cut Fills as in Settings, and press OK to leave the dialog. Zoom to the detail with Beam. As you can see, the cut surfaces and all layers have been set according to the cut fill settings of the building elements. Go back to the settings. You can set uncut surfaces using three different options, and you can also define a uniform pen color for contours. Finally, go to the last option on the panel and select the Contours Off mode to activate the shadows on the model and then press OK to leave the dialog. You can flexibly set different views in arbitrary cut planes with different cut fill and surface settings. These functions and options help you to create and design professional looking 3D documents.